This video will demonstrate how to add or set a new interface on a cluster setup while applying the entire configuration from the active member. We are currently connected to the active gateway and can see that on LAN 1 there are four VLANs. We will now browse to the local network page and add a new VLAN to LAN 1. In addition to the local settings, such as VLAN ID and physical IP address, we also have a drop-down for the cluster status, which is set to high availability by default. When this value is selected, we can configure the IP address of the peer gateway and also the cluster IP address. The host name associated with each gateway is part of the relevant fields to avoid mistakes. It's also possible to set DHCP server settings for this VLAN settings will be applied to the standby member as well. After saving the new VLAN configuration, it will appear in the high availability grid and the cluster diagnostics. In the 2D view, we can see that there are currently five VLANs on LAN 1. If we now go to the web interface of the standby member, we can see that the new VLAN was successfully created with the correct IP address.